<laughs> Watu wangu nimevaa red. <laughs> Sababu tume red, yani we red, yani soma. <laughs> School of Media Academia. Eh hey, by the way mu join. Sisemi kuwa red yani kuvaa red lakini mu join red yani ile kusoma yani ku read eh, soma kitu noma eh, ukiwa kwa hiyo club manze kuna venye ai 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 uta learn so much about media about advertising about marketing kawe ni mtu wa biz unataka kwa, kwa biz ama una, uko in the middle of business ama unataka kujoin biz soma school of media academia ndio hiyo utakuwa member wa hiyo hiyo soma uh, $47 a month na kwanza kama uko easy area za east coast west coast side za atlanta hiyo 47 a month si ni around $500 a year do you know utairudisha ju tuseme tunakupea discount za ku tumia sound equipment yetu ukinid dj wetu ndio hiyo ukinid venue yetu huku uko discounted tunakuteach uko na access ya classes uko na access ya tunaweza kutumia music licensed in case you need kuweka kwa content yako sasa zingine ukinid some form of licensed videos tunakupe yani kuwa kwa school of media academia is just a good thing alafu uko na network hii ni network tuna build pole pole ya watu wako na business ambitions na wengine wameachieve already so itakuwa noma itakuwa ganoma na iko noma saa hii cuz utakuwa na mimi kwa zoom class every week tuanze kujenga your your personal brand you know kama we ni wa physical therapy tuanze kukujenga as a physical therapy guru tuseme unataka kuanza your own physical therapy office kwenye uko na customers tunakujenga ndio your your neighborhood your people around you they know you as an expert in that field tunatengeneza branding yako noma tunakusaidia kujenga hiyo website ku merchandise manzi all the way tunakusaidia na tax strategies nini nini ai ai ai, ai. mtu wangu tafadhalini alafu kawe umejoin na uko mbali will will give you more and more things tutakuwa in touch na, na wewe one on one nikikuteach a lot of things na pia some of our professionals watakuteach pia a lot of things like you stand not to lose 47 dollars a month tafadhali mjoin support your very first Kenyan media school uh, online you know ini basically tunasemaga it's for education edu and entertainment purpose ndio tusisuiwe so lazima ya kila kitu ni sema this is for entertainment purpose only tusisuiwe na mtu ati oh nilienda shule ya sam then sikupata degree ah hii ni hii ni training ni courses ni online courses so ndio maana na you gain more saa zingine una gain more hata kuliko venye ulienda kole kwanza weka ni mtu wa marketing mtu wa nini ah join us join us tutakujenga tutakujenga but anyway <laughs> story ya leo i hope mko sawa this is mr sam the creative with banana land media and good people society hey hey mistakes zenye nimefanya financial in america nimefanya two major ones i think two major ones lakini nikihesabu zenye si major ndio nyingi zaidi mpaka hata this year i think nili blunder financially at some point so easy mistakes hazishagi mistakes hazishagi lakini Wache ni nimrudishe nyuma. Nimepanda masri mabeshte wangu tukosika. Nimepewa visa. Leo ni Sunday. Mande ndio napanda ndege. Sunday 
nilikuwa mali panaitwa ka nini kisherekea pale na wasanii fulani mande ndio hiyo imefika maboys wangu kawa wili wako na masri niso tuko wapi tuko sika wamesema man mbogi mzima inakupeleka airport na you know hiyo mbogi ilienda ikaanza vita airport na security thank god nilikuwa nishaingia huko ndani kasikia wengine walienda ku arrested but anyway walinisindikiza on our way from sika kuenda airport ndio ni pande ndege ni kuje North Carolina. He. Mnajua nilienda nikiambia maboys aje. Mimi na hiyo masomo nilikuwa nimeanza kusoma. Mkumbuke nilikuwa nimesoma book ya Tony Robbins Unleash the Power Within. Na nikasoma ingine ya Ben Carson Think Big. Ndio nikaona hii America lazima ni ikuje. Na thank God for reading. Others ningekuwa nimebaki huko. Thank God for books. So, hapo na jiona nimesoma vitabu mbili tatu. Hizo zingine nilikuwa nimesoma mbeleni ni novels tu. Lakini hizi mbili tatu niliona zimenichanua sana. Nikaona niko mbele sana. So, tukipanda ma nikienda nikienda airport. Tuko na maboys kwa mani so tumejaa. Wananisindikiza. No my boys wako mtu yangu usitusahau wengine wako hai usitusahau tu, ukifika mayolo mtu wangu usitusahau man usitusahau wako ma wako hapa nyenye maveve nini nimepelekwa na wase huko mwingine hapo alikuwa amenidanganya nivae suti ati nikifika airport hapo Atlanta na bila suti nitakuwa deported. <laughs> Mnajua nilichapa suti all the way. Aki ya nani huyo mse nikipatana na ye. Aki <laughs> Ah bana ali ni enjoy na kwa hii hata amewahi hata pata passport. Mse atajai toka sijui ajai toka zika mara nyingi. Ananiambia nivae suti. Na nikaingia box nikaomba kazini yangu Eric suti nikaivaa mpaka North Carolina suti moja guy eh tuko kwa Masri tuko kwa Masri tunaelekea tunaelekea Nairobi airport na sindikizwa na kina Vero Vero wako huku US big up to Vero ehe na wase kadhaa wako US already juni nilifika huku nikawa attract wote huku North Carolina hey hey ninaambia ma boys Mnaona zile plot? Mnaona hizi vichaka zote? Tuki drive sasa, tuko juja. Mnaona hii yote kichaka watu wangu kutoka kesho. Mkini drop hivi kesho muende muende leo mlale kesho. Muende mkiangalia hizo plot, muone ni how much. Mimi after kama 2 3 months nipate job tunaanza kuzinunua. Na nikaambia kila mtu kwa masri hapo plote yako iko yako iko yako niachane na watu wangu wa ghetto aje aje eh my friends 98 of those people atakuwa ipatana tena ama kuongea tena juu email hawakuwa nayo simu siku hizo watu waana ghetto simu mtoe wapi hata cellphone nazikuwa buda it was the end moja naitwa geta gitao ako hayo huyo ndio tulipatana baadaye na wenye nili attract huko North Carolina but wenye nili attract wako wa ghetto ni mabeste tu wa mabuda walikamu but mmoja najua nilikuwa na party na yeye sana Vero big up to Vero ana dupo sana kwa huku tu but nakumbuka nikikamu nikiwaambia tafuteni easy plot tunazinunua so nilikamu nikidhania nililand huko nikijua ah ni kuchapa wera kuchapa wera na kutuma pesa tununue plot ninasema hao watu wamekuja hapa nakuta watu wamesetto hapa 10 years 20 nashindwa kwa ni hao watu ni wajinga aje hao watu ni wajinga aje uliza unaweza aje kaa hapa US 10 years uliza mtu umekaa hapa 10 years na sijaona umejenga plot kama moja Kenya umekaa hapa 15 years na una mama mansion ka 
Unafaa kuwa wewe ndio una own kutoka Juja mpaka Nairobi. Hizo plot zote ka umekaa hapa America 10 years 15 years wewe unafaa kununua hata shamba zote za uhuru Kenyatta wewe we unajua hizo ni dola ngapi umejapa job 10 years manze nilikuwa naleta ngori hata nauliza wase niaje niaje 10 years mimi nitakuwa nimenunua factory zote Kenya ah manze nilikuwa roho juu plus nimesoma book ya Tony Robbins kitu yangu inaniambia ye, 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 ye. Tony Robbins ameniambia to awaken the giant within na ni kweli ili awaken ndio nikajipata na visa lakini mimi bado mindset yangu i needed 20 30 40 more books 50 more books to truly 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 change my mindset cause ya hiyo kukaa ghetto for so long nikiwa oppressed pale na ghetto tukiishi maisha ingine down hata tuendagi Nairobi sana kwa wadosi tukienda Nairobi ngara tukienda malipo udosi sana nimeenda kuona kazini yangu Eric pale 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 umoja wan nikikaa Nairobi kidogo ni club na kurudi mtaani siku exposiwa na lifestyle za wadosi watu eh wadosi tu wenye nilikuwa nao ni wale wa moyo academy primo na tukua exposed so ah mi niliona ah, 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 mi ah mi nimefika mi nilikuwa naona asani ku buy my plot my plot my plot kumbe bado mindset yangu bado hizo book mbili zilinitoa kwa ile shimo but azikumaanisha zitanipeleka sasa na ni kweli mpaka wa leo hizo book zinisaidia but hiyo time mentality yangu haingeweza ku receive a lot of that info kwa hiyo book inisaidia even more at least ilinifikisha kwenye nilifika nikaland wapi hapa kuland hapa I... ndio nilianza job the fourth day hizi za ku serve serve kwa ma kwa ma Hilton na ma Marriott hizo kachapa do ilikuwa hiyo time na chapa two jobs niko pale show university na chapa shule story hapo ni mob ya kuingia shule kuingia job story ni mob tutazisip eh after a few months hivi to after ka one month and a half eh best yangu ameniambia wewe achana na hizi job kuja nikuonyeshe job fulani ndio nikarushwa CNA Ihi kumbe hata hizo zote kabla hata ni pate hiyo CNA kabla ni pate socio kabla niweze ku drive he ilikuwa few months hiyo time yote nilikuwa na dropiwa but within three months mimi nilikuwa na gari na nilikuwa na license so ndio nikaanza kuona reality ala kumbe <laughs> sikuwa ni kuja nianze job kumbe shule ni 4000 a year E e e e e kabla nijui hata nimequit job. E kumbe nilikuja na pesa nikamaliza pesa ya Buda yenye alikuwa amebakisha sasa kumbe anadai ni mlipe back nilipie watoto wake shule wenye wamebaki my sisters. E kumbe hii najikuta la ni noma lakini bado naona ha natuma ako kamia Kenya kana lipia watu hii shule masiz natuma kanasaidia buda hapa na pale maze pale na bado nabaki na do so mentality yangu bado iko ah by in two years ah nitakuwa nimeanza kununua hizi plot hata in six months ah bado ndio nimeanza kugongwa na reality nimeanza kugongwa na reality na home hatu communicate siko nafikiria nikilanda america nita communicate na maboys aje wenye nimewaambia waende kutafuta ma plot hata hao ni wajinga walikuwa nadhania wata communicate na mimi aje at least mi nilikuwa na email na hizo kujanjaruka na ma email na nini hiyo time ndio zilinifanya nikatoboa juu ya ku apply ma shule na nini hizo vitu zote odho shule yangu ili niliapplyiwa na buda best yangu alilipa mtu akalipwa i20 ilinikuta tu kwa mlango Kenya so buda pia alinisaidia sana but anyway E e e e e Ndio nikaingia CNA. CNA ninalipwa poa nili eh, pale 
kwa Mario tu nachapa job nachapa job ndio unalipwa 8 dollars na si mbaya but CNA unalipwa 8 dollars nilikuwa na, nilianzishwa na hiyo 8 dollars na inataxiwa but umechapa dabu dabu umechapa karibu 70 hours in one week so check in come no no mtu wangu in two weeks ninaona 1300 1300 dollars ni nilipata cheki yangu ya after two weeks venye nilichapa ile job ya CNA kwenye nilipelekwa nikadanganywa nimeenda kucheza na mashosho kumbe nimeenda ku kuwaosha nilipata check after two weeks hivi juu ya kuchapa madabu juu unaenda hapo ka umechapa madabu hapo actually kabla uingie unaulizwa unaweza chapa overtime eh hiyo ndio qualification hiyo time walikuwa desperate kutoka leo unaingia CNA bila certification mimi hata nilienda tu nimefanya certification ya medtech nikakuwa medtech nikaekwa kuwa supervisor wa building zote nikadanganywa na 9 dollars 950 an hour nikajua mimi nimefika cheki yangu ya kwanza ya CNA niliona 1300 dollars na nimetaksiwa karibu mia saba imeenda juu ya kuchapa madabu na nimejaza niko single no dependents my friend Niliangalia hivi nikai deposit pale Coastal Federal Bank. Venye ili reflect hivi nilijua in two days iko sawa. Hiyo time tulikuwa na kadi but sidhani kama nilikuwa na on, uh, tulikuwa na online banking. But we unajua ukitaka kuangalia balance unaenda kwa ATM. Nilienda kwa ATM nikaona ala nilikuwa na kamia tano na nimerusha 1300 niko na 1800. Generosity yangu ya Kenya ya mtaani karudi. Hiyo siku nilinunulia niliingia job hivi 3 o'clock. By 5 hivi tumefeed mashosho 6. Njai imenigonga. Njako nigonga. Nimeambia mabeshte wangu wote kaa wanne. Niaje? Mnataka dina? Naenda Chinese. Si nilisikia kuna ka Chinese hapa. Juni nilikuwa nishaumishwa Chinese nika chizi. Una kama hapo unaumishwa Chinese una chizi. Mtu umetoka ghetto unaumishwa Chinese. Mchele imekaangwa unapewa ka na ka mixemo kweli nilifall in love na Chinese na mabaga nilifall in love nazo. Kuna watu toka Kenya wanakuja hapo wanasema eh chakula mm mm. Mi nilifall in love na hiyo juu nilikuwa una, naona hizi ni chakula za wadosi, mapizza ninaona ai ninakula pizza ai naweza nunua chinese ai 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 yani naenda nanunua kuku mzima kwa duka na ninaichoma na ninairarua tu na sembe na kesho naweza nunua ingine ai 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 bala noma niliona maisha imeingiana mbaya my friend nilibaia watu wanne dina kidogo Beshti yangu akatoka hall nyingine anaitwa Leon. Akaniambia hai me too. Ah, ni, you too? Eh? Nikamwambia you, nikamwambia you and everyone in your hall about three more, two more CNAs na one more medtech. You and the other one and the mwingine hall nyingine. You too? Manze nilinunulia building wakazo wote kwa hiyo building. Niliwanunulia dinner siku hiyo. Na nika swipe card. Hey, he, yo mande. Nkaambia Buda, ndio hii miambili yako ulikuwa unaitisha. Sijui kidogo, nimelipa rent mia saba. By the end of that week, so unaona nina wiki zingine mbili kabla nilipwe. By the end hii wiki ya kwanza, nilienda kuangalia account yangu ni si, si you are not thinking numbers. We unaona uh, 1800 Ah. Si pesa mbaya. Hii tutakula chakula. Imaliza 1800. Hapana. Ah, Na nimelipa rent. Hmm. Kidogo ni mekaeka tu mafuta. Mafuta hiyo siku 21 dollars inajaza tank. So kidogo nini? Ah. Ndio at the end of the week niliona ala nimebakisha sultano. Ile 30 imeenda yote na chakula nini 
Hii, sati ni menda yote. Nimebakisha 500. Wiki moja imebaki nilipwe nimebakisha 500. At least nilikuwa nimebaya nyumba. Uh, nime sorry nilikuwa nimelipa nyumba. Nikasema alhamdulillah, you know? Wacha ikue. Hiyo ni hasara nikaona haya. <laughs> Ndio lesson number 1 nikaanza kuingia. Ya 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 kumbe hii pesa inaweza chomoka hivyo. Hii ni dola ndiyo ni dola lakini naenda nilikuwa nina calculate 1800 dollars ninazika calculate into shillings ninaona nikaa niko na 180000 shillings 180000 shillings nitazimaliza aje na wiki moja manze kumbe nilimaliza 100000 na wiki moja kupeana nini nimetumia buda nimelipa rent siku shika adabu vizuri haya hiyo ilikuwa ka mistake Wacha ni tuende kwa mistake yenye nilimake. Yeah. Mwezi moja imepita nimeacha kununulia watu machakula nimeona ni kuno ni kunoma. Mwezi moja imepita nimerent kiapatu the lakes watu wa North Carolina rale nyi wote mnajua the lakes pale watu nime host pale the lakes ni more, more than 15 in counting. So watu wengi wanajua the lakes mpaka leo hiyo hiyo complex hizo apato ziko zinaitwa the lakes zilikuwa mpya siku hizo mzuri tumeingia pale Mia saba a month kidogo tumeingia tumesettle tuna viti viti kidogo zenye tumekuja nazo maybe tumepewa pewa na watu hii after one week naona ya account yangu tena iko na zao mbili Account ina saa mbili bana. Ah, nikaambia Marumet ni aje juu nilikuwa na watu nime host. Nikaambia mi si vizuri tukaage chini wengine wa kiketi. Ah, viti hapa si enough. Sio vizuri. Sio poa. Ah, nikaambia beshte yangu alikuwa amenisaidia mbeleni amekaa nikamwambia nipeleke kununua viti kaenda wapi kapelekwa eh, place ya furniture inaitwa uh, roads ilikuwa inaitwa roads kwa nika ilifungwa kufika pale roads nikaona viti nikasema guy hizi viti siku hiyo viti za leather size natoka 5000 dollars watu wangu hiyo time viti za leather size natoka 5000 dollars hiyo times ilikuwa zinatoka 1000 dollars do you know vitu zime increase in prices five times believe it or not niliona set ya couch inatoka zao na ni leather mzuri nikaachana na hiyo nikachukua ingine inakaa leather but si leather inakaa suede suede flani ilikuwa viti safi nikaambiwa Eh. Hizi viti ni around hiyo hiyo dhao na kitu. Nikambiwa mse, "Eh dhao, 100,000 Kenya shillings ni pesa nyingi." Abo yango akaniambia, "We utaacha kuhesabu dola na Kenya shillings, wacha hiyo ujinga." Anka mwambia, "Sawa. A thousand ni do mob." Akaniambia, "Eh, ni do mob." Na akaniambia, "Si lazima ununue hizi vitu." Lakini mtu hapo Rhodes akaniambia, "Hey my friend, you know you can go home with these seats without paying for them today. Ulipe pole pole, interest free for the next 90 days." Ai, interest free. E akaniambia, "Eh, hey, same as cash." Nikauliza boy wangu, "Ni kaa ile ART ya Kenya yenye unaenda unanunua vitu unalipa pole pole?" Akaniambia kitu kama hiyo nikamwambia ya 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 nikamuuliza na nitazibeba aje sina pick up akaniambia will deliver it to you for 50 dollars mo na that 50 dollars will be put in your bill so you can take these seats i'll go get your credit card give me your details nikampe details credit card ya roads wakanipe credit card ya 4000 dollars nikachukua viti za 15 za 1100 meza nikachukua ya 200 nikachukua sijui manini nini tutata nini hapo tuamia mia nilitoka hapo nimechoma zao karibu mbili 
kidogo a few days later nikaambia maboys mimi niliendaga mahali panaitwa Circuit City Circuit City ilifungwa but these days kitu inakaa Circuit City ni Best Buy ya kuza ma TV ma electronics nikaambia maboys manze nilienda Circuit City na boy wangu pale hivi nilikuta pia wana ma TV mzuri na si vizuri tukae hapa bila TV Maboezo wakasema alhamdulillah wao kwanza hawana idea ya credit ni nini jumi ndio nimewa host nimekuja wa kwanza Hey hey tumeenda Circuit City ambio ah you don't have to pay for this big TV Take it na ikuwa na katumbo kubwa huku nyuma kalikuwa katumbo kadogo ambio hii TV kwanza haina tumbo kubwa ni ile ya katumbo kadogo inakaa flat screen but flat screen bado aziko zimeingia ni zile zilikuwa zinaitwa plasma zilikuwa. Ah, akaniambia get it. You'll pay interest in 90 days as long as you pay it in 30 days you are good. Muliza huyo mtu wa Circuit City. We unanienjoy. Hata wewe kama mtu tu yule wa roads wa furniture unasema utanipay hizi free. Ni bebe muta deliver akaniambia hata tutadeliva peke yake tutakusaidia ku mount kwa ukuta utalipa 75 dollars lakini itakuwa part of the bill so you don't have to pay anything today kamuliza ya hivyo ndio iko yeah. ombia load it load it tukutane kwangu zililodiwa kakuja akaweka tv hapo na surround system juu bado aliniambia hii tv na need surround system Kamuliza hata hii naweza chukua na deni. Yes, load it. Jukwa kichwa TV 700. Sound system 500. Naona already na to the oko account na ninaona hii silipi leo in 90 days ndio ninaweza anza kulipa na interest. So in 30 days ninaweza amua nilipe yote. Hiyo ndio kichwa inanidanganya mtu wangu. Musi ni judge by the way. Musi ni judge. This was 20 years ago 20 years ago kijana mdogo nilikuwa 17 years old nilikuwa nimeenda saa kuingia 18 i think nilikuwa nimegonga ah nilikuwa 19 years nilikuwa nimekaa hapa kidogo a few a year or something 2 years hivi mm. ya yeah, nikibai tv ah man ninapoteza network nilikuwa hapa karibu 7 months Seven months. Yeah, nilikuwa 18, nilikuwa 18. Yeah, nilikuwa 18 years old, I think. Sikumbuki vizuri. But musini judge, yeah, I was young. Wacha tuseme I was very young so musini judge. Don't judge me. <laughs> Wengine wenyu mme make hizo mistakes mkiwa zaate. <laughs> ah! una make kuna mtu najua na make mistakes na akofote saa hii ana make mistakes zenye nili make nikiwa 20 anazi make akiwa 40 wanaume wanaume eh bana so many vitabu ni vitabu zilini save zilini save after two months niliona bill naambiwa eh hey, in two weeks You have to pay 388 dollars or else your interest will kick in. <whistles> Naangalia account sina hiyo pesa rent na ningoja. We Shindo ai kwani miezi tatu imeenda haraka aje. Juu nilikuwa natumiwa bill ya 19 dollars 19 dollars ah 19 dollars antalipa hata kan interest maybe itakuja 25 ndio nilikuwa naona hata 3 months ikifika interest itakuja 25 hakuna mtu alinijanjarua ati ni noma nilipata if you don't pay 388 dollars you, your bill will start going higher higher eh hey, three months najipata bill zangu zinakuja 500 600 za hizo vitu zote Naona lazima ni seta saa 600 ama nipigwe ma interest zingine azika hii interest. Juu nilipitisha ile time ya interest free. 
before i knew it moja ilikuwa collection before i knew it ingine ju lazima nilipe school fees kenya e ni me have kununua gari oh nini oh ni me have kuingia sijui ka shule oh nini ai 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 nilianza kuharibu credit kabla nikuwe na credit hiyo ni one mistake na bado baadaye si ati nililan nililan lakini si 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 kulan ju bado nilijenga credit back nikapata nikakam kugundua credit ni nini nikaambiwa hii una mess credit nikaifix ikakuja karibu mia saba. siku moja nikadanganywa na kitu tena mistake number two. nimepata ka contract ka serikali ka drop watu wametoka rehab wengine walikuwa jela na wa drop kwa manyumba juu wa rehab napewa ka mia saba every week na serikali na wa drop wengine na wapeleka Charlotte eh hey, kabisa kalikuwa kameingiana mzuri kidogo nimeamua ah hii gari napeleka nayo watu inaweza haribika nikaendelea nikaendea ka Ford Focus brand new kasema Ford Focus na ilipia 300 a month na insurance inakuja 400 hiyo time saa hii ukinunua gari hata ya upuzi kama Ford Focus utalipa mia sita kwenda juu ukiongezea insurance juu gari ya maana utalipa dhao kwenda juu ukiongezea insurance noma nikajiuliza sinichukue hii gari nikachukua gari brand new ana nikaendelea na biashara Four months later nikanyanganywa contract kashindwa gari napeleka wapi gari nilirudisha kwa factory mimi mwenyewe shikeni gari yenu imenishinda kulipa shikeni credit hiyo ya mia saba. <laughs> ilirudi mpaka 400 haya hiyo ni story yangu story ya boye wangu mmoja sahi ananusa 40 siwa hii state siwa anywhere near siezi mention Jamani show off mara ni Benz mara amenunulia demu yake sijui nini na ameacha na madem kadhaa mpaka wa leo ye uomba hata 20 bob saa zingine end of month ju amechoma pesa yake yote credit ameimaliza saa hii hata ameshindwa ako na deni ya credit karibu ya ako na deni karibu ya 100,000 ya credit card na hii usiongezee school loan alikuwaga shule usiongezee loan ya gari hii ni consumer credit jamaa ameoa sasa ako na bibi bibi yake pia ni spender my friend watu wanaingiza karibu wakiwa wili wanaingiza karibu 15000 a month But at the end of the day I want at a bob. We, I'm talking about now. Ana at a bob. Ju nile design. <laughs> Wanaishi Texas. Doi kiingia unaona New York. Unaona hapa pale pale pale. Eh hey, noma. Boy wangu as we speak ana file bankruptcy. Kimeumana kimemlamba. Bad mistakes watu wangu. Wacheni nisiendelee na history inaweza enda na iende na iende na iende na iende. But leo <laughs> Avoid ni deni. Ya America mistakes za pesa. Noma. Na hiyo mistake ya gari nikarudisha gari na msini judge bado nikajenga credit tena nikaanza biashara fulani ikaanguka credit karudi 400 nikaipandisha tena ikaanguka but moral of the story aya always fikiria sana kabla you spend number one. always think before you spend number two, 
ya Amerika kuwa na budget budget number three, don't think in shillings uko Amerika mtu wangu au uko gedhorai number four. Wenye wame make blunder msiwai give up nimeanguka blanda nika blanda saa hii wenye mko na access ya collection muende tu kwa history yangu 20 years down zile record ni nazo zitatokea kwa collection ni karibu pages ka tano. Unapata huyu mzee aliingia collection na si ati ninakosa kulipa bills nikitaka ni kujiingiza kwa manoma. Saa zingine ni biz, saa zingine ni ujinga kai hiyo time. Kuna time nilikutana na Goodin Junior yule ame act radio. Yule mblaki ame act radio, si mnamjua. Nilikutana na yeye nikiendesha taxi time za enzi zake za kitaxi. Tulikuwa na na nini? Hockey game national hapa. Hurricane walikuwa na cheza. Nikaona Goodin Junior na nilikuwa na tape yake VHS. Nilikuwa nimechukua Blockbuster. Tunaongea enzi za kitambo. Coincidentally, niko na DVD yake ndio huyu ameingia kwa gari. Hii DVD nimeirent kwa Blockbuster. Amenisainia autograph kwa hiyo DVD. Mimi niridushe hii DVD nani? Jamaa ataku ni tipi aliona hiyo ndio tipa alinipe nyang'au yeye good junior nyang'au wewe aku ni tip akanisaidia akanisainia na akaenda kuenda si nilikataa kurudisha hii DVD nikidhania ah ni 30 dollars watanipiga fine niwalipe kumbe mimi hata sikuwe ifuatilie nikashindwa hata wanitafuti ku niwarudishie tepe yao bado ni komunium new US but si sana nimegonga miaka kadhaa kabla nijue collection Goodin Junior alivanya niende collection juu ujinga yangu ku worship idols that was an idol i was worshiping akani excite nikakosa kurudisha DVD nikaingia collections so vitu zingine ni pure stupidity watu wangu you can only do stupid things for so many times kwanza ka umefikisha that 540 tungangane usi make mistakes zenye unajua zitakujenga vizuri later cuz si utobwa na mistakes acheni umegonga 30 35 kwanza 35 40 bado unajaribu ku show off na ma BMW huku na unajua pesa yako haitoshi mboga eh hey, zunguka na BMW zako na mabima na ma Benz lakini make sure you are earning almost six times seven times more than that bill. Kini sasa unaenda hapa ukiringaringa hapa ukionyesha watu venye uko mbele na ukidharau wengine na ukiambia mabeshto wako si ununue gari mzuri. Ah mimi niko na vani yangu Matilda hapa nje si mnajua Matilda. Bado ndio inanipelekaga. Na kabla ya hii tulikuwa na Matilda one ya blue van ilikufa ndio nikabai kashmani 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 wife gari yake ni mzuri lakini ameinunua cash kwa household yangu mambo ni cash money cash money na credit ka unayo mzuri sawa sawa ka una credit mzuri but usi abuse juko na credit mzuri yangu imekuja juu ikienda down but wacheni nimwambie as much as ukianguka credit wise you can always turn around credit card credit yangu imeanguka to under 3 under 4 under 500 more than 4 times kutoka nikuje america more than 4 times credit yangu imeenda chini ya 500 nikirudisha na ninairudisha mpaka napewa offers za nyumba so it's never too late to build back it's never too late my friends na mistakes za ujinga tuache learn from others learn from me learn from my friends wenye saa hii wana file bankruptcy jo ujinga yao na nikaa bado hajapata sense lakini wataipata tu watu wangu hiyo ndio story yangu leo 
mpaka wa leo hizo plot sijazinunua za kutoka Zika mpaka Nairobi nilikuwa naambia watu ah from next month plot zinanunuliwa ai 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 hata ile plot zile plot naweza sema ni nazo zimemea miti nyingi sijazijenga hata ziko tu hapo hata nikijenga unaenda kununua ma plot kichakani Kenya siweke pesa yako kwa portfolio ikuleteage tu 10% ama 8%. Badala ununue plot kwa kichaka. 10 years ago ununua na bado hakuna barabara imepita hapo. Unataka hiyo plot uiuze ukikufa ukiwa 90. Ya kueni chonjo, kueni na akili watu wangu. Hata hizi nyumba tunajenga saa zingine too big of mansions na haiwezi kuwa BNB kwa hapo tu iko kwa kichaka. Kueni na ujanja kwenye na ujanja make moves the right way watu wangu tafadhali school of media academia 47 dollars a month utapata education mzuri we are still adding classes na kabla classes ziongezeke nyingi tutakuwa tukikupatia one on one kama unataka kuwa a media personality kwa YouTube, Instagram kuwe mtu wa media, ka unataka kuwa mtu wa ku live stream events na ku shoot videos. We will teach you. Ka unataka kuwa mtu wa kupiga picha, we will teach you. Ka unataka kuwa na sound company, sound equipment, ka uko na kanisa na unataka ku train eh, watu wako, walipie hiyo 47 dollars a month wa kuwe wanachukua classes kutoka kwangu za sound. Kam mko Maryland nikipita nikienda job zangu napitia kwa hiyo church yenu ninawaona physically saa zingine ninaangalia venye wame sound, wame set sound system yao kuangalia tu ndio nione wanaendelea aje ama tuna meet tunasalimiana tu so mko na access yangu 47 dollars a month ukiwa na hizi vitu i'll make sure you make that money back in a way one way or another kawe ni photographer unalipa 47 a month uko kwa ile network yangu we ni member somehow somewhere nitakupatia job worth 500 dollars hiyo ni 47 yako ya the whole year imejilipa kasi wewe beshte yako ama kama wewe uko New Jersey ama Delaware we ufanya events umeniita nikafanye sound ni DJ ama ni fanye photography unakula 15% off just because you are in the school of media academia sasa so zingine you don't even have to join that school kusoma anything una join tu kuwa kwa a very good network yenye ina support in so many other ways please join today tafadhali join to get support this is a pioneer thing Eh, si kitu copycat nime copycat kwa wazungu ya yeah, but mimi si mtu wa kukopi copy wa Afrika wenzangu kenye wanafanya tina mini fanye a ah, ah. mimi ndio trend setter so let it this one be the first one na mwi support tafadhali tujenge kitu yetu tujenge vitu zetu venye wazungu wanajijenga nisaidieni kujenga e school of media academia kama ubanbika na content yangu sana na unaona unaweza learn kitu from me ingia 47 itanijenga na itakujenga within a year you will be a personal brand noma sana other is this is mr sam the creative with banana land media and good people society because you are my good people na nime toka Shukran watu wangu